Hey guys, Applepie Dev Team here. I just wanted to show you a cool little application that I found. It's called Tinker Tool. It's basically extended preferences for like for your settings on your Mac. And you can really customize anything from Finder to Safari. Like in Safari, you can um show develop menu and menu bar, you can just add a bunch of things to it, including like visible items and main history menu. And then you can change login items, and you can deactivate and activate what things you want to start upon logging into your computer. And you can turn off font smoothing, that's just a little feature. You can go through all your fonts and change what you want as the default for each thing. For example, if you wanted to change your system default, you just click change. And then you just go through all your fonts in your computer. With Leopard, you're able to turn on and off screen sharing, and you can change things in iTunes 8, like importing, you can play songs while importing, and then you can show like in spaces you don't want to wrap around when switching from last to first place, you can just change that yes or no. And then with applications, you can enable diagnostics view in a dress book. And in terminal, you could auto activate Windows by mouse cursor, cursor. And optical drives, you can add an eject button in the menu bar, like down in here. In general, there's just a bunch of features. Like you could deactivate the dashboard. And um, I have develop developer mode enabled for the dashboard, and I'll show you what that is. If you went into your dashboard. I could I could take my time app and then I could then I could do that and then it stays on my desktop without any um dashboard involved with it. Let's put that over there. Bring it up. Okay, and then with doc you can change things like use transparent icons for hidden applications and you can disable three-dimensional glass effect like you can turn it back to the regular 2D like it was in um, Tiger and then like placement you can change it to start position and position which is like to the left or to the right and then minimize effect as you can see there's an extra one called suck in and I can't show you what that looks well I can show you here I'll show you what it looks like you just relaunch dock and once it relaunches I'll show you the suck in effect I'll do it in um, slow motion holding down shift it's instead of um, genie it sucks it in I'll just open it back up and yeah that's about it so hope you found this useful and I will post a download link for tinker tool in the description of the video so thanks for watching and as always please subscribe